Hello everyone. Um, if you wonder why I'm looking so stupid with this hat, I have to wear it because um, it's quite hot. And um, I rented a bike, so I'm going to do some bicycle. I'm going to visit the Citadel today. I'm in Hue. This is the noon gate, and we, here we are going to enter. So um, that's the plan of uh, the Imperial City. It was built mainly from 1804 to 1833. Um, it was the most important center of political affairs and daily activities of the court and the family of the Angrian emperors. So it's a, a little bit structured. Here is a part where they have um, more administrative purposes or royal ceremonies and rituals and then in the middle is, is the forbidden city the forbidden purple city which is uh, only for for uh, for the emperor and his uh, his uh, concubines and servants and actually there's a death penalty on crossing that line back then so you were not allowed to go there um, here was the part where the queen's uh, or king's mother lived, and here is a park where the emperor and and uh, the family members uh, amused themselves and 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 studied. You can see particular Buddhistic sign of this little construction. Um, the imperial city was seriously destroyed by the wars in uh, 47 and 68. Today it has been gradually restored and enhanced in value and conserved. So um, this is what you pay basically entry for is also for restoration and reconstruction. They still working on it. So this is uh, the first entry after after the noon gate we saw at first, and this is basically where you walk when you're a normal. Visitor. So this is uh, basically the office of the emperor, and there's no allowed to uh, film inside. So this is uh, the front part of the forbidden purple city. Uh, I think it's a left and right Mandarin house here. This is the right one. These are high-ranking mandarins, probably consultants. Mandarins are consultants, right? Um, here you can make pictures if you wear emperor clothes. There's a photo service and then you're allowed to sit on the throne like these guys with his family members and concubines that's not me <laughs> so it's really sad but um, everything here was destroyed and actually where we were standing that was bombed and there were man to man fights here the walls are still a bit uh, demolished this is uh, the back side of the Forbidden Purple, Purple Forbidden City, where then this is very private area of the Emperor and his family and concubines. Uh, still kings until uh, 1945. The uh, imperial seals in gold. I'm curious. These are wood blocks from the Enguian dynasty, but it's Chinese, isn't it? So I wonder. Also, the little coins. So I wonder, um, did they write in Chinese or is that Vietnamese, old Vietnamese? This is under restoration. This is where our money goes to. Looks beautiful.
This is where uh, they were like a uh, garden study, amusement and leisure. I'm not sure though. Oh, reading pavillon. A nice little details on the roof. This guy on the left here. This is uh, the reading pavillon and uh, totally restored from 2000. 10 to 2015 pottery mosaic it's a really nice little royal garden Two hundred thousand. I can have a show. Probably no strip show. Like cinema or news. Latest news. Very cool. We have a snail horn. Buffalo horn. I find these stone chimes very particular. This is the modern uh, musicians. This is the, um, it was the royal treasury. It was built around 1900. And uh, they had a lot of gold and silver stored here. But then it also became the handicraft pots and they did kites and poem hats and paper flowers and what do I know a lot lanterns about 534 craftsmen people were working here and it's also part of the heritage of Hue, these craftings. Now they have uh, expositions for like past and present handicraft. It's really nice. I wonder how old this guy is. This is behind one temple. It's like there are non-existent buildings they have to construct them first if i understand well this king trung hall should be standing here there is nothing and uh in order to reconstruct it they first have to reinforce the foundation and all around the foundation. Ooh, that tennis court. It's actually no joke. The king uh, was very on the influence of the Winston civilization and he was very interested in driving, boat rowing, um, golf shooting and all those sportive activities. All right, that's it uh, from our little ancient capital city tour with purple forbidden city i hope you liked it i had about two and a half hours three hours i took it really really slow and um it's 150,000 dongs which is less than ten dollars um i like it a lot this is a star fruit tree by the way um, I hope you liked the uh, vlog. If yes, um, leave a message, a comment, I mean, and um, they took like uh, they took like uh, it's like the fifteenth, fiftieth picture they took. <gasps> oh, look! Yeah, it's cute. Uh, it's a nice place. I like the garden most. So yeah, if you liked it, leave a comment. 
And don't forget to follow and like and stuff. You know, thumbs up. See, tomorrow I go. I don't know yet what I do tomorrow. Maybe I do more today. Who knows? Bye. Of the exit gate. This guy is insane. Did you see him? Hey guys, I am in a hillbilly restaurant. Coco Snack is called in Hue. Absolutely hilarious waiter and I ordered a pizza and a Greek salad. I know it's totally decadent in Hue in Vietnam to do that. But I have everyday Asian food, so thank you. It's my birthday and <laughs> and I want it's I told you hilarious waiter. <laughs> Um, and I just want to have pizza. This is how they do ice cream. Ice cream roll. 